Welcome everyone, it is John, and I'm back with another Director's Cut. And today, we find ourselves in downtown Greenville, Tennessee. And you see this beautiful bridge and this water source behind me. Now this town was founded around this spot right here. Now this is a natural spring that comes up in the middle of town. So this place is full of history, a lot of really awesome places to go check out. A very charming downtown. So we're gonna meander around town and explore this place, so follow us. Now our first stop in this town takes us to this old log cabin. And this was actually a Capitol building way back in the day for the state of Franklin. Now, if you don't know this, a section of land here in East Tennessee actually seceded from the Union and became its own nation for a brief amount of time. It was, the president was John Sevier and they named it state of Franklin to try to gain Benjamin Franklin's favor, something to do with finances. 
However, it all came to an end and they rejoined the Union and now it's part of East Tennessee. But here is the Capitol building for the state of Franklin. So let's go explore it and check it out. Okay, if you look at this church, or directly across the street from, if you zoom in to just above that light, you'll notice there's something embedded in the wall. That is in fact a cannonball fired by Union troops during the Civil War. And it has been lodged into the wall of this church ever since. It's an interesting little bit of history right there. Awesome mural on the side of that building. Then we pan over to the beautiful Capitol Theater. I'll put some pictures up right now of the inside of it. But it's a pretty cool spot. I love the marquee on it, all the colors on it and everything. So cool looking. So vintage. Yeah. It's a very charming downtown though. If you look, I mean, it's very old buildings. It's just really neat. building snappy's five and dime store wow that's old that's an old building <laughs> You match the trees. 
I do, don't I? <laughs> Some of y'all may remember this from some of my more spooky videos. It's old Green County Jail. It's built in the late 1700s. Let's see if anything's changed inside. Ooh, it's spooky. Can't see a whole lot, I don't have lighting. But, oh, oh, it's gone. Oh, here it is. The old headstone of Sam Reynolds. No one knows how a headstone got here. But, we're in jail. Okay. This place is also home to our 17th president. Andrew Johnson. And just across the street is his home. And inside this building here is his original tailor shop because he was a tailor. We're gonna check those out real quick. And one inside here, and this was his tailor shop. Look around. Actually get a look inside of it over here. And they actually built this museum around its location. See some of the tables in there. Yeah, that old stove. There's a diorama. So what it have been like? There's the president there doing his work. One of Andrew Johnson's jackets. And there's his home. I actually have a video in there. Uh, we're not able to go in today, but uh, I'll link it down below if you want to check out what it looks like inside there. Okay guys, we're not gonna be able to eat at a restaurant today, but I wanted to throw a couple out there for you that are really, really good local places to come. One is Brumley's Restaurant. It's a good, you know, Southern food and it's a good local place to come check out. And then there's Top Choice Barbecue, which has some of the best barbecue in East Tennessee. So those are a couple good places to come eat and check out, and uh, I highly recommend those. So there you go. Okay guys, thanks for joining us on another One Tank trip. Now this is a beautiful little town. I've got a lot of videos from here, especially the old Green County Jail. If you wanna see any of those, they're linked down below in the description. But guys, this is a beautiful town I wanted to showcase it. I hope you enjoyed this. If you know of a town that's a tank drive away from Knoxville, Tennessee, let me know. Let me know all about it. I'll look into coming. But guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Consider supporting us on Patreon. It'll help us continue these travels and move forward. But guys, for now, y'all have a good one.